Curator's broken. Okay. Curator's actually just broken. Curator is the counter to demons, huh? Who the funk? Alright, cool. Greetings, traveler. Demon, Ellie Naga. Cool, I'm dead. It's only I'm dead. Haven't played demons in a while. Demon's not that good, but okay, I guess. <laughs> I like how I'm playing today. Even though I'm not um I'm not quite like this this um this mech game could have gone better, this this demon game could have gone better. But my mid-game decision making is a lot better. Bam. I don't have a rewinder yet. I just have to tell myself that. Probably up. Being on two for a winder is nice, but... Do, 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 do. Not bad of a shop? No, not bad at all. Not bad at all, one might see. Ooh, Pilgrim Beth already. Pilgrim Beth already, hands are sweaty, mom spaghetti. Anywhere but middle, and then we'll kill this. Anywhere but middle. Alright, let's take 7 damage. Smile. I don't want to save 7 health anyway. I love taking 7 damage as curator. Celebones kind of works with this. That's that's sort of the thing. All right, some nice celebones. Value. I'll take those. Is there Kanger in non-mech lobbies? No, no. Same the way, there's no Rewinder in no demon lobbies. The neutral minions are tied to their type like that. Oh. So I have a golden fiery Fellblood that also makes me take damage. I could take Stein again, grab the golden one, get a four drop, stay on tier three for a winder. I'm not overly opposed to that. I don't think I play the other one. I don't think I want to take an extra damage. So this gives me two health, that's a 4-6. I think they're probably both out. That's freaking expensive. I think we play that next turn, right? Gets the buff you, I guess. Poison. Ooh, maybe the cry foul against Galakrant. Yeah, I just realized I should have frozen the foul. That's a shame. Also, my damage did not go in the right places here. This foul bat dies though, right? Yeah, we good, we good. We don't kill this though, damn it. <clears throat> Yeah, Cry Foul was fantastic. My bad. I've got some fresh recruits for you. Great. Let's get some better minions in here. Rewinder. We're not buffing the shop yet, right? Titus is too greedy. Roll. Please. Could sell this. Well, just give me a rewinder. Come on. Ha! Yeah, we are gonna die. I think I might have to sell this now. Yeah, we're taking way too much. Okay, that's good. I have to play one of these. At least. 
Of course. Oh, actually, this was okay. Hmm. Damn, I should have bought that. My bad. I think I'm still buying it. At least we have a lot of damage on our board, so we can kill cards. No, we're not dead. Selling an 11 and 4 instead of a 3 4, having 10 health is risky, isn't it? What's your point? <laughs> Found our winders? Yeah. That's sad. So, yeah, I guess to, to answer your comment, right? You don't get to pick a good option when you are in a really bad spot. Or I wouldn't have been in a really bad spot. While you can say, oh, keeping this is risky, isn't it? Whether it's risky or not is not the question you should be asking. You should ask yourself, which decision that I'm going to make now is going to have the highest MMR return on average? Now that's difficult because you have to think through a lot of stuff. Surface level reaction is, ah, I'm dying, sell everything, throw everything on board, keep the largest minions. And then you're in a position where you have no chance to scale afterwards. And then you die anyway. So you can either make the decision that has a chance to come back, or you can make the decision that has no chance to come back, but is slightly less likely to die on the spot. The decision that gives you the opportunity to actually come back in the game is the decision that, on average, will have a higher MMR return. Have a good battle. Ugh. My dude has a fucking... Dude, are you kidding? Oh my god, that's so bad. I guess we died in... Uh... Oh wait, this doesn't die now though. No, and this is 35 damage for good. But it's difficult to reason like that, and if it was easy, then a lot of people would do it on the spot and do it well. Right, we found Bran. I'm gonna have to chest set my way out of this shit, right? Double Amalgam. Yeah, we have to chest set our way out of this shit. Buy the Bran, pay 3 health for this. Copy the Amalgam for sure, probably copy the Witch as well. This is out every turn. I think I'm gonna sell the 3 4 now. And then hold Bran. And then eat with these guys. We can also make double Implicator instead of double Bramble Witch. But I'm fighting 7 demons, so I think double Witch is better. So going for a comp is better than to buy garbage. I mean, it's, it's not that simple because what someone might perceive as garbage is actually a perfectly fine board, but it's not a specific comp. The thing you're asking yourself is which play on average, is going to have the highest MMR return. And of course, that's pretty vague. He was like, how am I supposed to calculate which one's going to gain me more MMR? A lot of the time, the question you should ask yourself is, if I make this decision, what are the odds that I actually get to build a board that's alive like two or three turns from now? A lot of the time, if you're going to go full defense, the chance you're going to be alive two or three turns from now is zero because you will have no scaling. You will have no out. There is no way for you to get stronger. And if there's no way for you to get stronger, then you're going to lose against people's boards. That's as simple as it is. Ah, oh, snipe the witch. Is that gonna matter? I got reborn. Nah, it's not gonna matter. Chess set is here to bail us out, boys. One health is all we need. Let's go. I need to either find this triple, I need to find a few buffs for this, or I need to get taunt to protect my witches. At the very least, I need taunt. Uh, this is sort of okay, but I don't think I want it. <laughs> it's kind of big, but I don't think I'm gonna take it. Oh, this would go great with my brand and my rewinder if I had any. I guess we're out of this. Ooh, that's kind of good. I 
I guess I could just play the Phalanx, but then I have to sell this. I don't like that. <laughs> so dumb. It's just taunting me, chat. I guess I can keep that coin. No taunt is sketchy, man. No taunt is sketchy. You could copy the Thrasher instead of the Witch, but you really want Witch in the front, right? Yeah. At this point, the game is obviously trolling. <laughs> we shouldn't attribute human traits to inanimate objects. <laughs> it's like you walk against the table, like, ah, oh, this table is fucking trolling me, dude. What the fuck? You are not out of this yet. Totally hit my toe on purpose. Ah! I need taunts! Alright, that was good. That's fine though, we have enough scam to beat this big boy. Bam. Ah, but who coded the inanimate object? Ah. That fucking table had orders, I tell you. <laughs> it dove for my toe right there. <laughs> That's cool. Uh, I think I'm gonna level just for more witch, but man, I want that taunt. I just don't want to waste my turn again. I guess I do need spells here. Mm, hang on, yeah. No, 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 no. Ah, thank you. That solves everything. That's taunt and spells. Um, do 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 do. I think we just tier now, right? Taunt the boy. Well, actually, taunt this guy is probably better. Well. No, 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 no. Because then they, then they can kill their thing instead of getting witched. Let's see. I like the taunt here because it's taunt divine shield. But the reason why I don't like the taunt is that our opponent can use it to kill off their Urzel instead of resummoning a 3 3. So the question is how likely are they to have the, the thing, the thing with the stuff? What's the downside of taunting here? That if he has Wind Fury, he kills both straight away. Yeah, that kind of sucks. Yeah. But this game is showing you why Curator is doing so well. You can just find a Reborn and then chest set your Reborn and now you have four poisons in a meta where demons are super strong. Alright. Ooh, we hit a Brand with that, but we have poisons, we're good. It's actually such a dirty scam, dude. <laughs> it's such a dirty scam. He's sitting there like, what? Bro, are you scamming me? Seriously? I'm like, yep, that's exactly what's happening. I'm scamming you. <laughs> How do you do, fellow demon players? Fellow demon players in the top three? How do you do? I too am playing demons. <laughs> uh, that's funny. Mind Shield gives me a spell at least. Some guy died to the ghost. Understandable. It's a demon meta after all. I want another shield. Come come. So that's Wind Fury. Poison and Shield are over here. Shield on this guy. The funny thing is that we're definitely not copying our 206 damage Divine Shield unit. <laughs> That's so sad. It's like, well, I'm not copying you for sure. I think I just roll for Witch or for more uh, Thrasher. Discover Thrasher or Golden Glow skill. Try Leroy. I should have played this. Uh, keep the taunt, I guess. Mm, that's kind of good to have. I'll just freeze that. Oh, I could eat it. Nah, don't do it. Good boy. Yeah, I win. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I kill his guys and then the witch kills him. <laughs> it's not even close. It's not even close. Bam! Give me my top two. I'm walking into that top two saying, hello everyone. 
Shall we play a nice honorable game of Hearthstone Battlegrounds? Dishonor! Dishonor on your whole family! Dishonor on you! Dishonor on your cow! I'm I'm down. I'm down. Oh my god. Alright, so I have a spell here. I guess Panda is a pretty cheap spell on average. Guess we'll see what I get first. Might need to head on turn. Yeah, upper hand for more skim, why not? Got 26 health. Does upper hand matter if everything has poison? I guess they could run into this. Right? Yeah. Could matter. Let's see if we get. Well, we could get another one. Right? Yeah. yeah, that's not useful. Ooh, I'm not getting another spell. All right, that's good. That's very good. This has to go. Uh, and that's my spell too. Ellie. Ellie. We just have to take the chance, right? We just have to take the chance. Ah, that's a shame. Atrocity, Jaraxxus. Could end on an atrocity, but does that matter? It doesn't really matter. damage divine shields you know it's not great but oh my dude doesn't even have a full board oh he's gonna have a bad time <laughs> you're gonna have a bad time son <laughs> what the fuck what is this disrespect what is this disrespect okay all right well let's do that one more time dude this is actually just cheating this is just actual, actual footage of streamer cheating again. These damn streamers with their cheats. Blaster kill is the biggest unit. Yeah, but it didn't matter. I was gonna get Bramble Witched, right? So it didn't really matter. Yeah, I guess I just find another Thrasher or another Witch. That's kind of it. Got a spell here. I've got a spell here. That's kind of a cheap spell, I guess. Uh, I don't really need Sushi Roll. Cultist could be a unit to end on, because then... But Amalgam doesn't come back with poison, so it resummon this 300. I think just looking for an insta-kill unit is better. It's not bad, though. It's not bad. Cultist won't resummon with poison anymore, they changed that. We're getting pretty close to the end here. I guess I can throw this on a Naga to try and hit. Don't actually want to win here this way. Kill the reborn. That doesn't matter. My guy is not taunted. But he kills my poison with that. Asparagus. And then the brand kills my other bramble. He's doing well, but he just can't do well enough to beat the reborn. The reborn poisons make it so hard for him. GG. Wow. Curator's broken. Okay. Curator's actually just broken. You hit a chest set, shit gets real hard for demon players. Wow. Curator is the counter to demons, huh? Who the fuck? Alright, cool.